White Mountain National Forest of New Hampshire, which consists of over 1,200 square miles of mostly wild space. And within these mountains and forests, there are placid lakes patrolled by loons, bubbling brooks. The most notable mountain in the region is Mount Washington. The White Mountains has an array of wildlife and many tourists that visit the area come here in hopes of seeing the more high profile ones such as black bear, moose and the loons I mentioned earlier. And who knows what else one might find. But today in the heart of the National Forest I find myself climbing this mountain to its windswept summit in search of something completely different the Maritime Garter Snake. Specifically, I'm going to a gestating site that I have been visiting repeatedly for the last several years. The Maritime Garter Snake is a subspecies of the Eastern Garter Snake. The Maritime Garter Snake can be found from northern New England to parts of southeast Canada. And within this area, Maritime Garters are truly considered a montane species. I have found them close to 4,000 feet in boreal forest type habitat. All right, that's enough of the commentary. Time to enjoy the scenery and get to the top of this mountain. So we have finally arrived and look at that splendid view. The gestating site is right behind me. This ledge over here, they utilize the ledge, those crevices in the ledge. And when it heats up or when they want to come out and bask, they go underneath this spruce tree. And I think I hear something. Yeah, let's, go, let's go around this side. A little, easy, a little easier to see. Definitely, oh yeah. Wow, wow, a nice big gravid maritime. Oh, actually there's another one right next to it. There's two. Uh, eh. All right, Emily, can you hold this? My wife. See if I can do a double capture here. I got her. I, I got both of them. Actually, I got one of them. The other one's going over there. We're going to have to go over there and try to get the other one. Oh, wow. At this gestating site, they love to hide underneath this spruce. All right, that was a success. Two gravid maritime garter snakes. This larger female in particular, look at that belly. Look at that belly. She's carrying 50, 60, maybe 70 babies. Garter snakes give live birth. This smaller female is carrying maybe half as many babies. And what's unique about these two individuals or comparing these two individuals is that the, this larger female has more of that maritime coloration. Namely, the rustic colored scales here on her belly and a more of a muted coloration on top, an olive brown, olive green complexion. This smaller female here has more of that eastern garter subspecies, a little bit of the canary yellow on the side a yellow dorsal stripe on top. So just up ahead here is the second gestating site that I wanted to visit today and with another splendid view. Just arrived at the second gestating site, a nice little ledge again with crevices. Just over here in this low blueberry bushes, two gravid females and ironically like the last location, one female is a lot bigger than the other one. So Let's quietly go over there and see if we can get a better look. Here is the larger of the two females. Another beauty. 
And here are some more shots from the last couple of years. Alright, time to head out. Thanks for hiking with me today.